The whole principle of the programme is um, we'll let you onto the playing field and we will level it as far as we can because we will work with you on those barriers that might affect your chances of succeeding in a job and then the only thing that stands between you and success is yourself. And in doing that, what we've demonstrated is that for the vast majority of young people, they can succeed. They're just like every other young person with aspirations, with hopes, with dreams that they want to achieve. 12 months ago, I wouldn't apply for any jobs, you know. I just did not think that I could go and apply and get a job. I just didn't believe in that at all. I just thought that was a myth. But now, with the skills that I've learned, like the interview skills and, the, and how to write applications and what, now, now I'm confident that I can put together a good work application. You can only work with a certain number of young people and the realisation that out there there are, particularly um, in Birmingham, just thousands of young people who deserve a chance um, and um, are not getting that chance. The energy that the young person's brought, the new ideas, the surprises, the just bring a whole new sort of level and texture to the workplace. That surprised me and until you do it and until you try it, you can't appreciate it. They're no different to any other young person, whether they're 17, 18, they're just starting work for the first time. He's valued, he supported the staff really well. And it was very low maintenance considering that the preconception, it was actually low maintenance, it was a benefit to the team. I mean, I know the back on track guy for us, he did help, help us reduce the cost on one of our things. This kind of programme, it doesn't only impact on the workplace and the individual, it's impacting on the siblings, on the parents, on the friends, on the friendship groups, um, because I think they're thinking that if their friends can do it, then so can they. From what people used to see me, I've, I'm not that same guy that they used to see about a year and a half ago or a year ago. Yeah, I feel like I can go as far as I want, as I wanted to be honest, as long as I put my mind to it and put the work into it. I remember when I started off in the course into like the it's like a little family there to be honest with you, like the way people get together and like go out for each other and that. I thought that surprised me, that really shocked me to be honest with you, like, that shocked me. Again, one of the memories that sticks with you, when I asked him how it was going and he said, I cannot believe how positive people are, I can't believe how nice people are and now I'm saying to my friends, why are you so negative? When people that I know and that probably was friends to you didn't show that kindness to me, and strangers did. That sort of gave me shivers because I was, I was, I, I've never seen that and like that before, and it's quite shocking, isn't it? It's just mad. I can't explain it. Yeah. It's just such a good like support and around me. That's what the good thing is. Like everyone just supportive and that. To be honest with you, it's like we liven up the place a bit more. To be Not that it was boring from the start. <laughs> you know, I had some people told me they started off as apprentices and now the managers and that. So that that really motivates you to think, you know what? You can actually do it because life is bigger than the end of your road. The world's really bigger than that. There is people that are actually trying to help. I think what we've demonstrated is if you give young people the opportunity um, and you just give them a start in the workplace and you provide them with the right support and you have faith in them that you can really, really change lives and not only change an individual's lives but also help to transform the communities in Birmingham.